Two years later, I mean, she's walking where we didn't know if she would have even survived. Exactly two years after a horrific experience and about 10 surgeries later, 14-year-old Adriana Riley is still alive. Her last surgery that she had, she had the skull put back in. Adriana has brain damage, one paralyzed arm, and needs a brace to walk, but is the only survivor following a deadly attack on March 6th of 2019 in Terrytown. That's when JPSO say Terrence Leonard allegedly attacked his girlfriend, Christina Riley. Her three young kids, Adriana included, and niece with a hammer. And with each year, the pain hasn't gotten any easier for the family of the four murdered. The anniversary days come up, and it's harder. Some people say in time it gets easy, but I just don't see how. They're still left with questions on exactly what transpired that night while trying to lift up the memory of the lives lost. I have no choice but to do what I have to do because I have two of my daughter kids that I still have to take care of. And with the message for those experiencing domestic violence, recent studies show rates have gone up by at least 8% nationwide amid the COVID-19 pandemic. What happened to my daughter? Please use it as a stepping stone. Don't stay quiet, because if you do, this is the results that you end up with. Now, Terrence Leonard was arrested and charged with four counts of first degree murder and one count of attempted first degree murder. Now, he does have an upcoming court date in April, and of course, WDSU will continue to keep you updated on what comes from that. But for now, reporting live, Shay O'Connor, WDSU News.